one of the things I didn't like about the control center was um, these switches they're not illuminated so uh, the water pump itself is kind of difficult because it could be on up or down depending on if the one outside is on so you don't really know if it's on unless you turn on a water source somewhere and it begins pumping if it doesn't pump then it's obviously off so uh, unfortunately um, for the water pump it's gonna have to stay like it is but another thing that I've noticed is uh, with the other switches is that you can't tell if they're on and which ones on so for quick reference when I open the door I want to know if anything outside is on or not and you can't tell with these switches I guess you could look and see if it's up but just a quick reference for a light like are what's supplied for the water heater oddly enough but nothing else so what I decided was I did some research and I went with these JR products mini illuminated switches and that's what I'm going to put on uh, my switches to the RV well, I've already put one lighted switch in and what I'm doing now is showing you what I did and what I've used I had uh, some 18 gauge wire here that will work perfectly well for ground and uh, RV wiring and probably most wiring black is black or white is negative or ground uh, depending on what the situation is and I had these little clips because the back of the switches have the little slide on clips and I had the clips from before and I bought this not just for this particular mod but for other things so I took my wire strippers there stripped them on both sides and attached the clips to one end you can see the next switch I'm going to replace is this one I've already done and the next switch I'm going to replace is this one right here and you can see that it's got two prongs on it for on and off and um, you pull them out of this plastic holder with using these little clips uh, they're there you depress them and it'll pull right out and you saw while I was messing with this one that I had a, uh, a different a, a bigger connector on here and that was just to see if it would work it was temporary in place but I've replaced that now and it's on there securely so let's turn it over and you can see that it's pushed through and now it is uh, out of its little holding area so I'll pull the wires from back here and install the new switch on these switches there's two white or silver color ones and one copper colored one the copper color ones the ground and you'll see that this has three legs to it whereas the primary switch I get that it only has two and that's because we got it on and off the purpose of the copper one on this switch is it is the ground for the light so if you connect a ground you connect this the uh, normal wires to these two and it'll operate but the light won't come on but if you connect a ground to this the light will come on understanding that took me a little bit so I took a the ground that came from the water heater it also jumps over to there's two of them an electric and a gas light and they jump to the ground to ground and then from there it connect that ground connected to the old dummy lights that went in here but since I replaced the old dummy lights with the sea level 2 that served as the ground so this is this one clump here for all my grounds to all the switches now if it's not grounded all that's going to happen is that the light won't come on there will be no power issues whatsoever uh, because I'm grounding all right the control center back at the control center this is a new improved as you've seen before the C level 2 
uh, well, I haven't posted either one of these videos, so I'm not sure which one will go up first. But I see the little two is installed at monitoring system, and I've got uh, lights, lighted lights for the inside and outside. I put blue for outside and green for inside, just for a quick glance. I could tell. You can see here, that's what it looks like. Turn the power on. Let's see if I can get them both in at the same time. Lights lit, off, lit, off. Outside, you've got the awning light. Lights are blue. The little porch light, those are both outside. That's why they're blue. And this is the little step light going into the bedroom. Um, the gas is already a lit, and the electric's already a lit one. And this little switch here I will talk about later. So that's it. Lighted control panel switch replace mod.